Mendes. I'm Rachel. I'm Ava. I'm Shannon. And I'm Ty. Today is Friday, January 6th. The Community Blood Center will be here on Monday from 9.30 to 12.30, and you must be 17 years old or 16 with parent permission to donate. See Mrs. Rado to sign up. Exams are in two weeks. There will be a girls' soccer meeting next Wednesday after lunch. There's a meeting for anyone wanting to play football next year, today, right now, during Focus. Have a great day! What's up, Bulldogs? It's your Westville and Mother Report for today with Big Trev and... Meadow, and your high is 36. And you got a low of 30. It's currently 33 degrees outside and cloudy. Uh, for the rest of your day today, it's going to stay cloudy. We got wind gusts up to 16 miles per hour. For your weekend weather, Saturday it's going to be sunny with a low of 25 and a high of 38. And Sunday we got a 30% chance of rain with a low of 27 and a high of 38. Have a great weekend. This is Sports Report. I'm Blake. This is Nate. And boys basketball plays at Northridge tonight at 7:30. Girls basketball takes on Layman tomorrow at 1:30 at Layman. And then we got the Bulldog Invitational for wrestling. Uh, starts tomorrow at 9:30, and we'll go on all day. So that's all of your school stuff. And for NFL, we got a big NFL weekend. Week 18, some playoff seating is going to be determined by some of these games. Uh, first, we have the Titans Jaguars. Uh, the winner of that wins the AFC South and solidifies their spot in the AFC playoffs. Then we have New York Giants and Eagles. That will be determining playoff seeding as well. And the Jets Dolphins. And then my Cleveland Browns and the Pittsburgh Steelers. Listen, if the Browns win, Steelers are out of the playoffs, which would be awesome. And Mike Tomlin would finally have a losing season. Hasn't happened in his whole coaching tenure at the Pittsburgh Steelers, but that would be awesome. So, yeah. What up, what up? It's your boy Chubby from Cooper Brown. Isaiah was from a player. That boy Kate did so much as facts. Violence hits Mexico cartel stronghold as El Chapo's son, Ovito Guzman, got nabbed by the Mexican military. Pickleball popularity exploded last year with more than 36 million playing the sport. Go play some pickleball. It's fun. Maddie B turns 19. Rowan Atkinson and Mr. Bean turns 67. Polo G turns 23. And Norman Reedus turns 53, which is Daryl from The Walking Dead. And Joan of Arc was born today in 1412. Have a wonderful day. What's up, Bulldogs? It's your boy String Cheese with This Day in History. So in 1066, Harold II is crowned King of England. In 1912, New Mexico joins the Union. In 1990, Theodore Roosevelt dies. In 1975, Wheel of Fortune premieres. And in 2021, the US is the US Capitol riot. Y'all have a great day. Hey, Bulldogs, what up? Is this Fettus the funny guy? What's your joke for the day? What is a twins fair for pears? <laughs> What's up, Bulldogs? It's your weekly trivia. This week's trivia is candy trivia. Question one, what was the first candy brand ever made? Question two, what candy bar is described as packed with peanuts? Question three, which candy company is the largest producer of chocolate in the United States? Question four, what candy bar is the same name as our galaxy? Question five, what was the first candy bar to combine chocolate and Christ, or crisp rice? Question six, about how many candy items are produced each year? Question seven, what is in the center of a Ferrero Shea candy? Question eight, what candy bar is advertised as a cookie bar? Question nine, what candy's motto is to taste the rainbow? Question 10. Milk chocolate was invented in which country? And now for your answers. Question 1. What was the first candy brand ever made? Good and plenty. Question 2. Which candy bar is described as packed with peanuts? Snickers. Question 3. Which candy company is the largest producer of chocolate in the United States? Hershey Food Corporation. Question 4. 
What candy bar is the same name as our galaxy? The Milky Way. Question five. What is the first candy bar to combine chocolate and crisp rice? Nestle Crunch. Nestle Crunch. About how many candy items are produced each year? More than seven billion. Question seven. What is in the center of Ferrero's Shea Candy? A whole hazelnut. Question eight. What candy bar is advertised as a cookie bar? Twix. Question nine. Which candy's motto is taste the rainbow? Skittles. And question 10, milk chocolate was invented in which country? Switzerland. Have a great weekend.